guys, it's Miss Emma here from Tiny Toes Ballet and today I'm going to dance with you. We are going to dance the story of the very hungry caterpillar. Now before we start, we will be using some special props in our dancing, which you might have at home or you can go and find different props that you want to use. So let me give you some examples before we start, then you can pause the video, go and get your props and then you'll be ready to dance along with me. So the first thing I'm going to be using today is a caterpillar puppet and I'm going to pop it on my finger to do one of our special dances. Now if you've got a caterpillar puppet that's great but if you haven't maybe you've got some other puppets at home or maybe you've got a little sock and you could put that on your finger. So that's the first prop you need, a puppet or a sock. The second prop you need is a scarf because when we are a caterpillar we're going to do some hiding. Now if you haven't got a scarf you could use a tea towel instead. That's our second prop. So a scarf or a tea towel and the last prop we need to make some noise with our instruments. I've got a maraca but you could use some rice in a bottle or some pasta in a bottle or any type of instrument is absolutely fine. Now, if you pause the video and go and get those three props and then we'll be ready to start. See you soon. Ready for our warm up? Let's just practice our moves. We're going to bend down small in our chrysalis and then pop out of the egg. We're going to shrug our shoulders, wondering what food we're going to find to eat. And what about those butterfly wings? We're going to lift our arms up and down to show you the strong wings of a butterfly. Let's get ready all together to warm up. Can you wiggle your fingers like a caterpillar's legs? Brilliant! And now let's clap those fingers together. Big smiles everyone, it's lovely to dance with you today. Now let's get ready to go into that little egg. Curl down small, ready, pop out of that egg. Well done, and curl down small caterpillars. Ready, pop. Oh, brilliant. I wonder what food we'll find to eat. Can you shrug those shoulders? Up, down, up, down. Well done, everybody. Now I'd love to see some beautiful butterfly wings. Long arms, lift them up and down. And up to the sky, down to the floor. Well done everybody. I wonder if I could see some wiggly caterpillar legs. And let's see if we can touch those toes. Well done, and stretch up high and touch those toes. Brilliant, give them a shake. Let's see if we can clap well done again. Big smiles everyone. You are great caterpillars. We're going to bend down small into our chrysalis caterpillars. 
need to warm up our feet so we can search around the room and find some food for our caterpillar. So let's stretch our legs out in front of us and sit with a very long back. Now caterpillars have got lots and lots of legs. We've just got two legs. And caterpillars' legs that move, only six of them move. One, two, three, four, five, six. All the rest don't actually move. Shall we pretend that we've got six legs as well? One, two, three, four, five, six. And what we're going to do is we're going to point our toes down to the floor and up to the sky, getting them nice and warm, ready to run around the room and find some food. And the other thing we're going to do is point one toe down to the floor, one up to the sky and swap. That's the tricky part. And finally, we're going to see if we can practice getting some apples off the tree by bending one knee up to the sky, up to the apple tree to pick an apple or pick an orange. Okay, are we ready to warm up our ballet feet? Sitting up tall. Are we going to point those toes?
Watch you next time when the music stops. class and in our usual class we would do some more dancing we would even go to a birthday party where the caterpillar has eats all of this delicious food and after he's eaten all of that food he starts to feel rather sick now my caterpillar is here and he's got a very sad face have you got your puppet ready or your sock ready or your caterpillar ready well, let's pretend that we've got our caterpillar and he's feeling really sick and we need to cheer him up. Can you give him a big smile? We're going to dance with him and keep checking if he feels better. Are you ready? I bet you know this song. Are you ready to clap? If you're happy and you know, clap your hands. If you're happy Thank you. 
have to go to sleep in his chrysalis for 14 days. So this is the final exercise of our class today and we are going to use our musical instruments to sing and to count and to recap the story of the very hungry caterpillar. Are you ready? Now let's touch our head, shoulders.